Good evening and welcome to Case Close. Today we investigate a man who microwaves grenades. It is literally just as stupid as it sounds. It's incredible how somebody could possibly microwave a grenade, still be alive and microwave more grenades. Uh, luckily, no houses were harmed in this dude's uh, plot to eliminate all microwaves, I guess. Uh, but a lot of microwaves were harmed. But they just bought new ones, so it's not really working. Why not go after, like, the supply companies? So then, like, all the microwaves, after they after they die, they have to go back and buy new ones. But there will be no new ones. Whatever. Uh, let's look at the suspects. Is it A, Fred? Bring off, Brad! Is it B, Larry from high school? I hate that guy. I absolutely hate that guy uh, because he he would always want to be in the military, but he always, whenever the teacher used a microwave, did like that vampire thing and hissed at the microwave, like, <laughs> or is it C? I don't know any other suspects so is it see that tissue on the floor it's been giving me a weird look for the past three hours let's investigate this crime in order to catch fish you need bait which means I need to bring you to a different angle for the first time in a while uh, we need to go to where the microwave is. So let me just take you to where the microwave is. Oh, hey, welcome to the microwave. So, <laughs> it's been a while since we've been somewhere else, hasn't it? It feels weird. But the microwave is right there. Someone's gonna come along and then, you know, um, put a grenade in there and then kaboom. It was, uh, it was Larry. Uh, good news. Yeah, we caught him. He's in jail now. Uh, that's a serious crime in this town. Like, super, like, stage seven. Stage 69 crime. Like, you, you, you put a grenade in them. You, you ruin someone's microwave. Mm, you're basically, like, death sentence. But, uh, yeah, it was Larry. Uh, as you can see, he completely disregarded the fact that there was a camera in front of him and only focused on the microwave. For the first time in a while, it's not Fred. Freak off, Fred! So I think we can uh, say this case is closed.